Hello, my name is Catherine and this is my fourth YouTube video. Yeah! This is following on from my previous one, which was 23 questions Australian Australian people have for British people. Um yeah. I've I shot this immediately after the other one, that's why I'm wearing the same top and everything, so just so you know I'm not you know I don't know. Don't know what you think I am. I'm going insane. I can just feel it already. So 24 questions Americans have for the British. Just <laughs> besides driving on the opposite side of the road. You know, our side of the road makes, m makes much more sense to me because it used to be where the carts drove on and you'd ride and you have to have your right, right hat, like with your sword, ready to fight people. So it makes sense. The le Never mind, let's not get into this. Why do you call cookies biscuits? Because they're biscuits. Well, actually, we call we call like chocolate chip cookies. We call them cookies. Um, I don't know what's the difference between cookies and biscuits, but like biscuits are awesome anyway. So, better yet, what do you call America's version of biscuits? They look like scones or scones. I say them both ways. Um, are they soft or are they hard? Because, I mean, I can't tell you what we call them if I don't know how. Because they look, they look like rolls or scones. So, scones, scones. See, I say it both ways. Why do your judges still wear powdered wigs? Those have been out of fashion for at least 200 years. I mean, it adds quite a nice tradition to it. I quite like it. I quite like the fact Powdered wigs and the hammer. It's cool. Uh, why do you call diapers nappies? Because they're nappies. Why do you call them diapers? Ooh. Burn. Burn. How many times do you need to be reminded to mind the damn gap? It's just added to a part of our psyche now. We have to hear it. I mean, <laughs> and got underneath the picture, haven't you seen enough gaps not to be constantly reminded of them? I mean, some, on some station platforms there, the gap's wider than others, but also, like, we know to mind the gap, we're not that stupid, but having that there, I mean, hearing it could actually save, you know, it could save someone, so... I don't mind putting up with it if it helps people. Why do you drink tea in literally every situation? Literally everything it's got underneath. I really like tea. I actually have a cup of tea over there <laughs> ready for me to start editing with my cup of tea. Tea is awesome. I mean, I, I can't, I can't really explain it. I haven't got the words. I'm not quite. <laughs> that just popped into my head, Electricity by uh, Alan John and Billy Elliot. I love tea. How on earth do you deal with the weather? How do you deal with your weather, America and Australia? How? Because I can't deal with it being sunny and hot. I know in like Austra Austra America, you like have your snowy part and your sunny part and your middle part. <laughs> Oh, a beautiful description of America there, Catherine. Um, no, but in Britain we just we just deal with it because we're awesome like that. I mean, I've grown up in Britain, so the way I deal with the weather is I deal with the weather. I wake up in the morning, look out the window if it's raining, grab a coat. If it's not raining, I put a coat in my bag because chances are it's going to rain some part of the day. Um, <laughs> Yeah, no, we just deal with it. It's not, it doesn't rain. I mean, I think we moan about it a lot. It's not like the worst rain. 
It's not like torrential downpours all the time. I, th I think we kind of send that message across. <laughs> like, yeah, we moan about it an awful lot, but it's really not that bad. I mean, I quite like rain. Why do you have two taps instead of one? I actually, like, in there, that's my own suite, in there. There's only one tap in there. I personally like two taps because I get to gauge my temperature. I like my bath and stuff. I gauge it a lot easier because you can go that that much of hot water, that much of cold water, ta-da. Whereas you kind of have to do kind of code cracking. Why are you all so stoic? Always with a stiff upper lip and it's got David Tennant hair trembles with emotion. Uh, if you ask me, I think it comes from our history because of the stuff like the Blitz and stuff where we all had to bundle together and yeah, in we had to, yeah, no, we all just get on with it. So, I mean, I'm quite an emotional person, but if there's something to be done, I'd rather get it done than worry you know, not worrying, but get emotional about it. Yeah. <laughs> How many BBC channels do you have? That's like the mood. Um, serious question. Are there any other channels in England besides BBC? This is a Tumblr post. Yeah, so we have <clears throat> BBC One, BBC Two, uh, BBC Three, BBC Four, BBC Five, BBC One HD, BBC Two HD, BBC Parliament, BBC News 24, CBBC, CBBS. Is there anything else? There's also the radio. If you're talking about BBC channels, there's also the radio channels. But it's 11. <laughs> How come you're so obsessed with the royal family? And it's got this really, really cool picture of the Queen with loads of stars in the background. I love the royal family, but I know some people in Britain who aren't. Um, so we're not all obsessed with the royal family. I think in some aspects, you, America, were slightly more obsessed than we, we are. Especially in Will and Kate. Like, I was watching, like, stuff like Glee and have Will and Kate be mentioned and stuff. It was like, oh, okay. So, that's a thing now. But, I love the royal family. But, I don't... I don't think Britain is obsessed with them. I mean, they're, they're, they're our royal family. We can get... We, we can be obsessed with them if we want to be. With you, it's weird. You're... <laughs> with America, you're... You're getting obsessed with someone else's royal family. I get whatever you want to do with your life. That, that's, that's your business. Why do you pluralise math? <laughs> do you want more than one math? No, it's not math. It's maths. And I know that's what the whole question is. But math is short for mathematics. And that has an S on the end already. So it's already pluralised. So it's maths. 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 I don't like maths. I don't want more than one maths. But there already is. Mathematics. <laughs> Sorry. Just hissing at my screen. <laughs> How is this a condiment? And it's got mint sauce. Mint sauce with lamb is awesome. Don't diss. Do not diss. And I know someone in my, in my flat who likes eating mint sauce sandwiches. I personally don't like the idea of that, but lamb and mint sauce, very nice. So don't knock it till you've tried it. Why do you call lines cues? Because they're cues. I like saying it like that, <laughs> cues. Um, yeah, I don't know. Why, why do you call trousers pants? Why do you call... <laughs> you... With like stuff like sidewalk, trash can, it makes a lot more sense. I mean, we call it pavement and bin, which to me is right. But you've got the sidewalk, you walk on the side, it makes sense. I, I see your logic, but I, I will say pavement because it's British. 
And finally, how come your cursing and slang is so much better than ours? We've had years of practice. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> it's just got Ian McKellen in the game. You have to see this. It just has him saying bollocks. Codswallop. Wazzock. We have, we have so many cool slang. But some of it, because like, let's face it, America, we, British, we've had longer. We've had longer time. You, you will get there eventually. You can nick some of ours if you want. Actually, don't. Stop nicking our words. <laughs> I say our words. Te technically, the, British, the English language itself is based on German, Latin, Greek. God knows what. So, yeah. We, <laughs> we've we nicked some. But, yeah, no. The cursing and slang is something I'm very proud. Very proud of. I love saying. Right, so that's it. 24 questions Americans have for the British people. Done. Dusted. If you think I did a good job, um, please give me a like and subscribe for more videos. And also, if you think you have even more questions, put, put, put it in a comment. Also, British people, if you think I didn't do a good job and want to just add something else, feel free. Hopefully I'll have something new soon but i'll be i'll be revising and working hard hopefully <laughs> so see you next time bye